an IO technology system is likewise noted. It is deeply disappointing that incorrect and inaccurate reporting has been sensationalized in recent media reports that has neither been tested nor proved. Subsequently, these baseless and untested facts have been used by opportunistic elements to gain undue traction and media attention. The Federation's official position at this stage is that no authorizing structure of FEDUSA at any level has ever given a mandate for the acquisition of shares from any company in the name of the Trade Union Federation. The attempt to link FEDUSA to DFEMA Holdings, a company associated with General Secretary Dennis George in his personal capacity and independent capacity, is incorrect as the two entities have got absolutely nothing to do with each other. FEDUSA has never been stronger and more resolute in its call for good, clean, ethical governance, which operates with integrity and in the best interest of building a better South Africa for all, including its affiliates. Advancing FEDUSA's Congress resolutions, our focus on calling out corruption within the state and private industry is well known, and we remain committed to that cause. The Federation remains no less resolute to this commitment, even if it involves one of our own. An external investigation will be conducted to determine the veracity of the allegations. With regards to the position of the General Secretary, the Federation will follow due process as required by law. Rest assured that the outcome of the full-scale investigation by FEDUSA will be communicated to our affiliates, social partners, and the media on its completion. I thank you. Thank you very much, Captain. Uh, we can open up the questions now. Can ask all of, all of the leadership. I mean, they, they, they will have the questions. So may you raise up your hands? Yeah. OK, go ahead. Introduce yourself and then let us. We just mentioned shares on, on the purchase of shares. Could you explain how much shares are we talking about for both entities and bought privately and for producer, and when were, were they bought? Just to give clarity on the purchase of shares. I think we'll talk about three questions at a time. I think we can please. Can't you take one? Just, one? Just, if you could explain as well like, how much was. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much uh, for the question. Uh, let me indicate that uh, at no stage did FEDUSA bought shares. So as far as we are concerned, there are no shares that FEDUSA has bought from any company. So it will be difficult for me to tell you when they were bought uh, because from us in our structural maintenance, we have never approved or discussed the issue of buying shares. Thank you. Viewers can continue to watch that briefing on Channel 404. And like Uh, thank you very much for the, the question. The status of our General Secretary, Comrade Dennis George, is that he's currently on special leave. Uh, 
Uh, the Tato, thanks for your question. Uh, from the leadership, we just learned this from the media last week when we saw a media statement, and we were all uh, taken by surprise. So that's the first time we, we, we knew about that. Look, remember we're a trade union federation. We have got the affiliates out there. Now, the, the, the information that has been broadcasted out there by the media is such that it warranted us to make an investigation simply because we are not aware of the issues that are raising. So it's best if we give him a special leave so that it gives us an opportunity to follow up these allegations that are raised in the media. I think in, 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 in any employment setup, it is always fair that uh, you, you, you first do your, 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 your investigations, and uh, when you are informed, then you can take other processes that are provided by the law. And it is on that basis that uh, as, a, as, a, as a trade union federation, we are simply following that process. Hence, it has been put on special leave. Tato, maybe you must re 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 repeat your question. Uh, I did not uh, logically follow your, your question. Yeah, look, I, I, I think let's get uh, facts straight. Uh, the meeting that you referred to, there was never made mention of defamation as the question raised. If the question raised the question of I or then, we're going to answer it to say we dealt with this matter in our November meeting, Mencom meeting. In our Mencom meeting in November, we dealt with the question of the non-directorship in the IO technology solutions. There was no mention of the FEME holdings in that discussion. Hence, all of us became aware when we um, saw the media uh, News 24 last week on the 30th. I hope I've clarified your question. Yeah, yeah. my colleague would also want to come in here. Thank you. Teto, thank you very much for the question and the follow-up in, in that instance. I think the misconception and the misrepresentation, specifically in this regard, when you couple the issue of IO to the PIC is the underlying factor here. At that stage during the management committee meeting, the issue of IO only was discussed. The recent revelations in the media now only attempt to couple the two, and that is the basis on which we are having this media conference here to, 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 to state what the specific aspects are. So during that stage in November, it was only the question of the non-executive directorship. 
So let us just clarify that issue so that we don't couple the issues here now because then it was fact on one hand, but now there's another actor at play that you so duly bring our attention to. So we have to separate the two issues. Thank you. I remember when you were, when when there was issues within the PIC, I think around 20, uh, 2017, those, these press releases that uh, Fedusa was issuing regarding the, um, its support for the CEO, Machila, at that point, very vocal against the, the state capture. I'm just wondering whether, you know, now that there's these tainted allegations, you know, people are going to start connecting the dots. I, I don't know whether that that concerns you. I'm just I'm just asking. Uh, look, it does concern us, but you must understand that uh, our general secretary is the mouthpiece of the organisation. And when we discuss issues that affected us as a trade union federation, obviously he had to go and represent our views. We did not know whether uh, those particular interests, as you say, were there then. But we are concerned as, as, as a trade union federation. But unfortunately, at this point in time, uh, these things have already happened. and. Uh, uh, our view is that, as I've indicated earlier, the only thing that we can do is to follow up in terms of the investigations that we've already alluded to, or that uh, will go to the bottom of this matters, and only when we are correctly receiving the report from those that would have uh, uh, appointed to do the investigation, will then understand how we do we process the matter going forward. Thank you. I think I've already alluded to the fact that uh, the MENCOM has applied its mind in this regard, and uh, we have given ourselves a time frame that uh, if everything goes according to the plan, uh, by the 25th of this month, we should be having a report, and the MENCOM will sit and evaluate the report, and from that report, the MENCOM will then decide on the way forward as to how do we then manage that report uh, going forward? The, 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 the team that will assemble to do investigation will do the investigation both internally and externally because we want to go to to, 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 to the crux of the matter so that we understand what really happened. Because it's only fair that when you get the correct, relevant information, that you would then be able to apply your mind in terms of what next step you should be taking. Okay, can I just give my colleague just to make some additions to, to that? I think what the president has alluded to is that, and as I understand the question, is whether the um, investigation will be dealt with internally by the FEDUSA people or externally by an outside party. We have taken the decision that a task team had been put together which will go and source an outside party to do an independent investigation from extern uh, externally and then from there after the report will be presented back to the task team, which will um, put the report forward to the MANCOM on the final date, which would be preferably the 25th, latest the 26th. So what they would do now, they would one-on-one, one -on -one, just to, to 
very technical houses. So if you may avail yourself, all of you, you have the best day. Because there okay. might be some questions that we need to help each other. So Thank we you. start, uh, we want to construct SAPT or This one will be live, so they're going to cross live. No problem. No problem. It will be live. So it will be easy to sit here. Okay. <coughs> individual interviews. Thank you. But I think most of the cameras are smart. Yeah. Yeah. hard for you. I'll read you my makeup tonight. Ah la la. Yeah, uh, go. Yeah, we're going with me. Yeah. 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 Please take note that there's men come on managing this thing, I get this one that.
Frank, Frank, are we done? Can we leave? No, eh? no they're waiting for. They're waiting for? They'll call it from the studio. Oh, okay. Good afternoon. My name is Mali from the SABC. Mali. Mbali. Mbali. Yes. All right. Um, My name I'm is Masale Selematsi. I'm sorry. Masale Godfrey Selematsi. Okay. And I'm the Step president of Edusa. Pleasure meeting you. I'm going to stick to Godfrey. Okay. Uh, you're saying I didn't have the time for stopping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'm serious. That is absolutely, okay. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> so because I'm Zulu, you know. I understand. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, still in yeah. Still in oh, yeah. So basically, we're just uh, talking in communication studio. Yes. Just finding out when is a convenient time and a convenient time to people crossing. Um, so it's j it could be at two o'clock, right at the top of the hour. Okay. Uh, Any time between now and then, they'll just decide on whether they have enough time. It's just that today there's a lot happening because there's the DET thing happening and all of that. So it's just a matter of you know trying to you know balance things out and give, because they did come live to, uh, they did take the, 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 the briefing uh, mm. part of this live. Okay. Um, so we'll see what they do, what they decide okay. to do, but at uh, 2 o'clock definitely at the top of the hour, but then we should have crossed. I may have to catch a plane, <laughs> that's what I'm asking. Oh, what time is it? It's uh, quarter to four. Oh. Yeah. If I keep you but if I, long, but, you know, uh, yeah, but if I do it, uh, before quarter past. If I leave here around quarter past two, um, I think I can manage because I already checked online. Mm -hmm. So I'm sorry, okay. the other thing um, that was asked about is the Fedusa Com. What is Fedusa? Fedusa Mancom, Management Committee. Management Committee. So we just abbreviate it as Mancom. Management Com. Okay. Yes, Management Committee. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah. We'll call you. Mm -hmm. I'm asking, is radio and TV? This lady, this one is radio. This lady, oh. SABC radio. Oh, SABC radio. Yeah, this is, this one by SABC television. Oh. This one is already filing from the left of the story. Oh, that's good. That's how good technology is. Mm -hmm. uh. It's an aim to be the one on one. It's just going to be with God, uh, God's will. So we can leave. Huh? But I wanted you to be with him because oh. yeah, just to... Yeah, but I'm moving to now to a different room. I don't, I mean, I don't mind, but I want to move to a different room. I let him clear. Okay. Because all that is smooth sometimes, I mean, li like you did with that mm. question, that, that that's okay. a, I'm coming from that perspective right, so that we help each other. I'll sit with the president. Mm. <laughs> no, we must. <laughs> Yeah, he's the he's the right hand lady. <laughs> yeah, my yeah. right hand mm -hmm. lady. Yes. Yeah, no, I, I think I didn't get the gist of that question. Yes. You know, I just thought uh, whether it means that. And they can exploit that president. Mm. Yeah. That's why. Would you maybe you would? Yeah. Mm. yeah. So but you did well. Yeah. That's why I handed over to you. They wanted to this mm. come through as that mm. they're going to do it in court. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. They 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 might they might make it. 
sounds sad, like mm. something else, you see. So mm. there's always that thing there. Okay. But we are immediate, you must tell us these mm. things, the principles, because yes. some of us were too far from this uh, yes. Uh, yes. life realities. Who changed you? So you heard that lady is sending it to to her colleagues already. Yeah, to to the to, to the, the system station. to the system. To the I used to use use that laptop. Yeah. Because I used to sit with, with her for many years. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So and from then when the, you do that, uh, it's the going directly to the server. Yeah, server. Yeah, it's going to the SAP server. The news, uh, they, they take it from the when the the broadcast. The broadcast. Okay. You know, just. It's called the president. Must I come there? Yes. Okay. Well, we're still waiting on there. Oh, so but I must come and stay yeah. in front. Yeah. Okay. But Frank wants me there also. Can I just hide underneath the table? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. No, but you sit in here, you'll assist. Yeah. Yeah. Let me come. Yeah, no, I'm fine. This, this feels like the this can, slide, can we go away? Yeah, can we go away now? Yes, you can. see. Okay. But Frank said I mustn't leave you. No, no, it's fine. If that time you can use the table or something, yeah.
It depends. I hate to mind you, they've just gone to the mining in Daba, so they're going to speak to that person for a good five minutes and then maybe go to an ad break and then test and then come to me. <laughs> Heidi knows this all too well. We have an SABC3 uh, channel, so that's why they can cross to me. But I think 404 is on that. It's probably on that DBT thing. Just ten. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
so we don't have a profile. They should. Hello? Hello? Hi. Gapilunjani? Oh, hi, Lungile. Three minutes, okay. I'll stay on the line. Okay, thank you. Good afternoon, Nzinga. Indeed, FEDUSA has refuted claims that it, um, it's distanced itself rather from this transaction that you speak of, and it's also refuted claims that it's approved any, the, it's mandated, um, uh, d now suspended, not really suspended, but um, Secretary General, I'm just not sure what to call him if it's suspended, but he's been placed on special leave. But we'll just continue for the sake of this crossing, we'll just continue to call him uh, FEDUSA Secretary General. Um, they've said that they did not mandate him to buy any shares from um, AO, that technology company that is in question. But um, to talk to me, I am joined by the FEDUSA uh, President, Godfrey Silimadzeli, who is Silimadzela, who will explain further as to why um, Dennis George has been put on, on special leave. Thank you so much for speaking to us. Please explain to our viewers why um, Dennis George has been put on special leave. Uh, thank you uh, very much and your listeners. Uh, what I want to put it on record is that as for DUSA, in our meetings, there was never a time that uh, we came with a decision to buy any shares. And the reason why our general secretary has been put on special leave is simply based on the media uh, <coughs> uh, reportings that purport that he has bought shares for the Federation in himself. Now, for us to be able to deal with this matter more accurately, it is our belief 